Welcome back to the Gnome Show, everyone. I'm Josh, your humble host, and it is my duty, nay, my pleasure, to trawl the briny depths of YouTube so that I may bring you the shinies. I cover short films of varying genres, video games, analog horror, and sci-fi. Anything else that I think is groovy. I hope you enjoy tonight's offering. Content for the Blood God. Now on with the show. Tonight we have... Uh, Owl Hijack and Prisoner by Siltrix. These are in the Batman Analog Horror series uh, by the channel of the same name. Uh, go over and show you love. His shit is amazing. Um, let's check it out, guys. Um, cue the end of the music. Huzzah. And let's boogie. Any place, any time, is a good time for Coke. Only Coca-Cola gives you that refreshing new feeling. Refreshing new feeling. Refreshing new feeling. Coca-Cola bright and lively. Coca-Cola has more zest. Coca's a lot more zest than living. Refreshing zest. Only Coca-Cola gives you that refreshing new feeling. Refreshing new feeling. Send the Talon for the Bat's head. Okay, so uh, that's the assassin they send uh, to try to kill Batman. I don't think that one works. All right. And now for uh, the uh, main course, Prisoner. Batman Analog Horror by Siltrix. tell you all what happened to the other people and why the bat does what he does. This is a photo of the man who kidnapped me. Thank you. 
modified version of some substance known as venom. to go through the procedure, even though I was the fourth person he took. The woman before me was a robber who went by the name Cat Woman. What the fuck? Who the bat had a thing for. This is the photo, this is a photo of the cat woman. Pretty fucking cool. She tried to put up a fight but got put down and taken somewhere. Then it was my turn, which was actually earlier because one of the prisoners got out. I was then led and tied up to a chair where the bat started the process, not before telling me about himself. joining him to rid Gotham of the criminals. I told him that I needed that he needed serious help and called him a lunatic. I mean people still call Bruce a lunatic even now. He didn't like that response and released a gas called fear toxin. Restraints were removed. So I used this opportunity to run. When I ran, I felt like I was being followed. Then something attached to me and tried pulling me back. It was a sort of rope. Luckily, there was a sharp, bat shaped object that fell, which I used to cut myself loose. chasing after me, although he didn't look like how he did before. When I was exiting the cave, he just stopped. After I was able to run out of the house, I started to hear rumbling. picture of him. This is the image I drew. Holy shit. So that was Prisoner, 1962, Batman Analog Horror. Um, that was pretty fucking cool. Um, so I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, make sure you go over to Siltrix's uh, channel. Check out all the other stuff he has. It's, it is, um, especially if you like analog horror. It's really good stuff. Um, other than that... Um, like, subscribe, share, follow, all that kind of good stuff. Uh, be safe, be happy, be healthy. I love you all. I'll see you in the next one.